Operation Guidance Video for Remote GPS Module Monitoring Software. First, insert the mobile car into the GPS module, charging parameter, and then connect the GPS module with the equipment by the network cable. After confirm that the connection is correct, connect the power supply to the storage battery end of the controller. The LCD screen will be on and the green indicating light of the communication module will be on. All this information indicating that the power supply of the communication module is working normally. Next, proceed with the APP operation. Open the device monitoring software. Click login. Click the username and password. The username and password are provided by the factory. The default password is 126. Click Sami. Click the device. Click the icon in the upper right corner. Select the communication mode. Select the remote management mode. Return to the main interface. Click the solar controller. Click the MPPT controller. Click the device online. Enter the device monitoring interface. And observe the following parameters. Charging parameters. Load parameters. And the device parameters. When the machine gives alarm, we can check the warning information interface to judge what kind of alarm the machine gives. Setting parameters. In this interface, you can change the specific value of the parameters and the load parameters interface. Factory setting parameters. You can check the information of the factory setting. There are two shortcut switches in the monitoring interface, of which the charging on off is controlled the PV charging on off, and the load on off is controlled the DC load on off. We can operate it through the shortcut switch. The above is the operation guidance video for remote GPRS module monitoring software. Thank you. Instruction video for computer side monetary equipment. Open the browser. Enter the website address of 47.96.131 column H0A9. Enter the monetary background website. Switch interface language to English. Enter the username and password. The username and password are provided by factory. The default password is 126. Click login. Click the dashboard. Click the device management. And click the device list. At this time, you can see the device 101 is online. Click Equipment Monitoring to see the operating parameters of the current equipment. You can also switch to Custom Setting Parameters and observe the Custom Setting Parameters. You can also return to the home page. The above is the operation instruction video for computer-side equipment monitoring. Thank you.